We begin tonight with breaking news from Marshfield. The bomb squad called in after a suspicious device was spotted this afternoon in a busy area near Brant Rock. Good evening, everyone. I'm Bobby Sis. Thanks for joining us here. Let's get right to our Jim Smith live in Marshfield this evening with the latest on this. And Jim, certainly this caused a scare this afternoon. Absolutely, Bobby. A very scary situation here in the town of Marshfield. I'm going to get out of the way and show you investigators still on the scene here in Brant Rock. Picture it. It was a beautiful Sunday afternoon, nothing at all going on, and then suddenly a report of a possible bomb. Anxious moments in Brant Rock. Police, fire, and the bomb squad converging on a Marshfield neighborhood. It all began after reports of a possible bomb lying in the middle of Ocean Street. Nearby residents were told to get out. All they said was, you have to leave. And I said, let me get my pocketbook. And they said, now. And I grabbed my pocketbook and I came out. The street was closed and the experts called in to analyze the possible device. Then authorities destroyed it. A suspicious device was pointed out to a police officer who was down in the Esplanade on another matter. He activated the fire department. We secured the area, called the resources of the Massachusetts State Police Bomb Squad with their technology. They've investigated. They've rendered the device safe. It is now a criminal matter, and the Marshfield Police will be working with the Massachusetts State Police to bring the matter to conclusion. Nobody was hurt. The investigation continues. It all made for a very nerve-wracking Sunday. And we weren't too sure what it was when we went walking down here because we usually walk down the street and I asked one of the officers and he said it was suspicious it looked like a pipe bomb. Back here live in Marshfield and we do actually have late confirmation from the fire marshal's office that this device was in fact a pipe bomb. So as you might expect, the investigation only now just beginning state and local authorities still on the scene here. But the news is that at least nobody was hurt. They destroyed this device. The investigation wide open. We're hearing reports that at one point at the beginning it was possibly thrown out of a car window at the beginning of all this, but that hasn't been confirmed yet. But once again, the fire marshal's office now saying that this was a pipe bomb. Live in Marshfield, Jim Smith, WBZ News. Bobby, back to you.